What is up, my breaking family? Sending some positive vibes in your direction. And today, I have a little bit of Pokemon card history for every single one of you. We are going to be taking a look at the very first ever Nintendo produced Pokemon TCG set. This one right here, EX, Ruby, and Sapphire. Now, a couple months ago, a longtime friend gave me this right here as a present, and I have yet to look at it, and I figured we would go ahead and take a look at it in today's Pokemon card opening. So this is from the year 2003. It is an EX Ruby and Sapphire Ruby theme deck, and I believe it is complete, but I don't know for sure. We'll take a look at this today. Like I said, it is the very first ever Nintendo produced Pokemon TCG set. So we will take a look at that a little bit later in today's video, but we're gonna go ahead and start off with a Pokemon card opening. I got some unbroken bonds right here. I got some Cosmic Eclipse. We will see if we cannot pull a Hyper Rare Charizard from either of these sets, Unbroken Bonds or Cosmic Eclipse. So let's go ahead and start today's Pokemon card opening with Unbroken Bonds. Of course, there is a Hyper Rare Charizard and Reshiram from this set, which I believe is actually still pretty valuable because it's a, a very playable card in the competitive uh, competitive scene. So let's go ahead and see if maybe possibly we can pull one of them today. Tangula, Ghastly, Sandshrew. Wait a minute. Kanto vibes all the way right there. And then Aaron had to ruin it for all of us. Energy. Kraka, Raka, Raka, Raka. Fairy Charm, Togetic, Tentacool, Reverse Hollow, and a Per Ugly. You know, it's very rude to call somebody ugly. Per Ugly, we love you. There's a code card right there for the Pokemon TCG. Let's go into our next Unbroken Bonds booster pack. Charizard and Reshiram. Now, what I want all of you to do in the comment section down below is since we're going to be looking at this EX Ruby and Sapphire theme deck, I want you to let me know some of your memories from the Ruby and Sapphire era, um, whether it be the video game or whether it be the card game or just anything else released around that time frame. Go ahead and let me know in the comment section down below. I would love to hear some of your nostalgia. Um, and uh, yeah, yeah, just tell me what you like about that era or your stories or just what you remember collecting from that era. All right, Unbroken Bond, still going strong. Let's do another booster pack. We got Lucario and Melmetal as the pack artwork. Urgh. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Let's get a hollow. I'm feeling it in this one. Hollow rare. Let's do it. Let's make it happen. We've not gotten a hollow rare yet. Okay. Kanto, Squirtle, nice. Okay, let's see if we can keep those Kanto vibes going. Oddish, they continue. Crab Brawler, ruining it for all of us. Froakie, Litten, Energy. Triple Acceleration Energy. Triple Acceleration Energy. You know I'm going to do it. Triple Acceleration Energy. Glysaur, Laron, Glysaur again, Reverse Hollow, and a Wigglytuff just when you think it's not a Wigglytuff. It's always a wiggly tough. All right, and there's the code card for that one. Whoosh, wow, that was rude. Um, did I give you the code card for the last one? I don't know. There it is anyways. Let's go ahead and go into the next one. I'll put that right there and that right there. Now, I currently, you probably can't tell, but I currently uh, am working on the studio uh, as far as lighting goes. I have, I'm, have some lighting being installed up here on the ceiling and uh, we tried to get it done before today's video, and unfortunately, we did not because um, we kind of had no clue what we were doing. So now we are waiting on an electrician to come and take care of it. Um, there's some crazy wiring thing going on up there that we've never seen before, so that has to be taken care of. And now, um, and now there's another room beside this room that actually has no electricity because uh, we did something to this right here. So. Uh, we actually have a, an extension cord running from over here to this back wall right here because this half of the room has this half of the studio. This has power. That half doesn't. So uh, we have an extension cord running to light up the blue light that you see back there as well as the Pokemon arcade machine uh, right there. So hopefully we'll get this taken care of before the next video. 
Um, it really doesn't affect, you I mean, you can't really see anything, but uh, I would like to get it taken care of because the lighting system, I think, is going to highlight the background uh, a little bit better. So hopefully that will be taken care of very, very soon. Adult stuff. Uh, Porygon 2. Clef. Uh, Mer <laughs> I almost said it wrong. Marowak. And Hypno for our rare. Wow. Where was the hollow rares in that one? None. We just opened up how many? We opened up five Unbroken Bonds booster packs. Not a single hollow rare from that set. Oh, well. Code card for that one. I don't know if I gave it to you. Let's go ahead and not wait any longer. Let's go ahead and take a look at this EX Ruby and Sapphire theme deck. Like I said, a friend of mine gave this to me a couple months ago, and I have yet to open it up and look at it, and I figured now is better than ever so let's go ahead and take a look at it together like i said earlier make sure you let me know in the comment section down below some of your memories from uh the ex ruby and sapphire era for the card game or maybe just ruby and sapphire for the video game i would love to hear your nostalgic stories or just some of your favorite things from that time period so right here is the very very front we do see blaze again we got Fighting and Fire inside of this EX Ruby and Sapphire theme deck right there. Ruby theme deck. Of course, it is still the e-reader series. This was released in June of 2003. And like I said, this is the very first set uh, that Nintendo produced after the license was transferred from Wizards of the Coast. So, as you know, the earlier sets were made by Wizards of the Coast. And then uh, Nintendo started producing them once uh once this set hit right here so this is the very first ever nintendo produced pokemon tcg set right there on the back we do see torchic uh inside this box 60 cards one randomly uh selected holographic foil card one pokemon coin one rule book one card list and the counters um there we go there's uh, if you want to read any of that i'm not going to read everything to you but there is all of that right there uh, we do see the official Nintendo seal of quality. That that logo right there is just nostalgic. It just it, it's so nostalgic. Whenever I see that logo, it just makes me happy. And then of course the Nintendo logo right over there, and then the e-reader logo as well. So let's go ahead and open this up. We've taken a look at the outside of it. I have uh, counters falling out of the bottom of the box. So that's a good sign because that means it's uh looks like it's pretty complete. Then okay, here we go. I think everything is out of there. All right, more counters. Nothing else inside of the box. I'll set that off to the side. Ooh, nice. Look at this. Whoa, I have not seen this in forever. Breaking family. We are on a nostalgia trip right here. Pokemon Battle E-Card. Sapphire version, Ruby version. Whoa, nice. And then right over here. Lady Astrid, wow. This is bringing back so many memories. This looks like there's more than 60 cards in here. It said, it said 60 cards, right? Inside this deck, you'll find 60 cards. Okay. Each player must have, okay, wait, wait. This looks way more than 60 cards. Um, so here is the rule, wait a minute. Is there two theme decks in here? Card list right here. There is the card list right there. If you want to take a nice look at it, you can pause the screen. Take a look at that right there. Of course, there is a Mewtwo EX from this set. I think the value of it right now is roughly around $20. And the rule book as well. I think this is actually two theme decks crammed into, uh, into one box. Uh, just kind of all stuffed in there. Okay, maybe uh, we did not know this. I have, okay, this is interesting. This is interesting. There's the two coins right there. How well can you see that? Ooh, nice. We got Mudkip. We got Torchic right there. And we have our theme decks right here. So we got Machamp. Look at that. Ooh, these are in good condition too. Nice. Nice. This is a, a very lovely present. Machamp. We got Machoke right there with the belt on. Yes. Machop, Torchic, Skitty, Makuhita, Combuskin. I mean, do you see how well these are? These, like the condition of these? These are really, really nice. Uh, and that Machamp is a rare, by the way. Talo, Skitty, Poochiena, Torchic. I'll go through Rainbow Energy. We got Potion right there. 
Blaziken, and that Blaziken is a rare as well. You see it right down there, the rare logo. Nice, Delcaddy, is that a rare? I don't think that's a rare, is it? Nope, not a rare. Delcaddy is not a rare, sorry about you, Delcaddy. Swellow, looking swell. Not another Blaziken, there we go. There's our, uh, our fire and fighting. Got the e-reader logo right down there in the corner. Gotta love that. Professor Birch. And more fighting and fire energies. Pokeball. And what else do we got here? Energy Search. And we have a Loomberry. That, that's uh, some classic artwork right there. And then this other one over here. I think there's, there's two theme decks in here. Yeah, oh, Sceptile. Look at that. Hollow Rare Goodness Breaking Family. Look at the artwork on that, especially the background, how Sceptile stands out uh, stands out in front of that background. Whoo, that's nice. And of course, that is a rare right down there. You see that? Weezing. Oh yeah, this is definitely two theme decks in here. Wow, okay. I, I, I did not know that. I thought it was just gonna be one theme deck inside. Coughing, Marsh Stomp. So this is a nice surprise for me, just as much as it is for all of you, Breaking Family. Whalmer laughing about something, uh, and that Whalmer is not a rare. Well, wow, Pelipper, ooh, wow. I remember that Pelipper. At one point, I really, really enjoyed the Pokemon Pelipper, and uh, for some reason, I just lost interest in Pelipper after a while. Swampert, Wingle, Trico, another Wingle, Mudkip, Where's that Mudkip squad at? I know you're out there. I know you're out there, Mudkip fans. Potion, energy removal, uh, Pokenav, uh, another Mudkip, Potion, Professor Birch once again. Wow, we could actually like sit down and play this. Me and Marie could sit down and play these two theme decks. I mean, look at this. These are actually in really, really good condition too. Not bad at all. I'll have to ask my friend if these were ever even played. These might have never been played before, so... Wow, okay, right there, two theme decks. I didn't realize we were getting two theme decks. I thought it was only going to be one, but Breaking Family, the very first ever Nintendo-produced Pokemon set, EX Ruby and Sapphire, and then right back there. I mean, that that's that's a, a nostalgic memory. Look at that. Oh, whoa, I didn't even show that one. Meet the Battle Trainers Challenge. Yeah, I didn't even show that one. I totally missed that. All right, I'll set that off to the side. Nice trip down memory lane and all of that right there. And let's just go ahead and jump right back into these Pokemon card openings. I got some Cosmic Eclipse for all of you. So let's go ahead and uh, open these up. And of course, we are trying to get one of every single card from Cosmic Eclipse. The biggest Pokemon set in TCG history. Pokemon TCG history. Um, I'm crazy for trying to get one of every single card. I think we're still missing like 30, 34 ultra rares, and we've opened up hundreds and hundreds of Pokemon packs from this set uh, and still need lots of ultra rares. But if we pull anything that we need for the binder, which is right back there, we will put it in the binder, the Pokemon card binder, at the very end of today's Pokemon opening. Mallow and Lana and Alolan Muck. For the rare inside of that one. There's the code card right there. We're not having the best of luck uh, when it comes to anything hollow rare or better at this point. But that's okay. It's not all about the hollow rares. It's about having a good time, enjoying yourself. And we definitely are doing that today. But I mean, let's be honest, Breaking Family. One ultra rare would be nice. And at this point, one hollow rare would be nice. But I'm not one to complain. I'm not one to complain. Nose Pass, Litleo, Energy, Red and Blue, Lana's Fishing Rod, Vaporeon, Secret Rare, Piplup. This is considered a Secret Rare, so Secret Rare, Piplup, and a Heliolisk, which I feel like I pull in every single Cosmic Eclipse opening, and I actually do not have any sleeves sitting beside me. None whatsoever. Actually, I think I have a couple right over here that I can get. There we go. Let's go ahead and sleeve up that Piplup. Nice. Okay. Go into our next Cosmic Eclipse booster pack. See what we got. We have yet to pull the Hyper Rare. Uh, not the Hyper Rare Reshiram and Charizard, but uh, the Hyper Rare Charizard and Breaks in from this set. So 
That could happen in today's Pokemon opening. Spiel! Energy! Lily's Pokedoll, Togedemaru, Great Catcher, and Venusaur and Snivy, Ultra Rare, Breaking Family. I feel relieved. Finally, an Ultra Rare pull. It happened. All right, now we don't have to worry so much. There's the code card right there. I'm going to go ahead and sleeve up that one. Venusaur and Snivy. Whoop, there we go. Right up there at the very top in the VIP section, the very important Pokemon section. Going into the next one, of course, we do have Sword and Shield coming out very, very soon. I will be going to pre-release tournaments and recording that as a vlog. And, uh, of course, we'll do Sword and Shield openings in that as well. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Uh, Sword and Shield gets released on February 7th, so uh, pre-releases start two weeks prior to that. And, of course, we will have the, uh, have the pre-release right here on the channel, just like we do every single set. Woo, Bat! And a Drampa. There's the code card right there. So make sure you hit that bell notification icon right at the bottom of your screen. Get notified whenever a new video goes up. I upload four to five times every single week. Ah, and you can rush over here, grab yourself a code card, leave a comment, and just uh, enjoy some Pokemon with me in a positive environment where everybody is accepted. Um, we don't judge anybody here. And some of you may not like me, and that's perfectly okay. Maybe this is the first time you've ever watched this channel, and you're like, you know, I don't know if I like that guy. That's okay. I like you. You're still welcome here. Krillia, Bishar, all about those positive vibes, and a Blasphalon. And a hollow rare, Black Kiram for the rare. There's the code card. We have a couple more Cosmic Eclipse booster packs left. I have a three pack right here that we are going to open up. Try our luck with this three pack. Ugh. And for those of you that have been listening to the Shadowless podcast, the new episode, episode number two, will be dropping this Wednesday. So make sure you stay tuned for that. The Shadowless Podcast. Uh, it's about Pokemon collecting. Uh, me and Jordan Fringe host it. Another a YouTuber. Uh, we host that and, uh, you know, we tell our, our Pokemon collecting stories. Uh, just stories in general. And um, we have a lot of things planned for it. So, episode two will drop this Wednesday. Alright. Rowlet. Skrelt. Pikachu. Teddy Ursa. Nosepass. Energy. Tag Call. Death and my ease, chaotic swell, bravery, and an Ursaring. Ursaring is another one of those rares I always feel like I pull from Cosmic Eclipse. And Cosmic Eclipse, don't get me wrong, Breaking Family, I love it. But it's a difficult set to pull, to pull ultra rares from. Trust me, it's not just you, it's me as well. I have some difficulty pulling ultra rares from this set. We have a Spiel. Alolan Meowth looks like it's up to no good. Pass Simeon. Jame. Oh, 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 oh. Energy. Floet. Zangoose with those David Bowie vibes. Love me some David Bowie. Zatu. Secret Rare. Giant Heart. Breaking Family. There we go. There we go, Breaking Family. Secret Rare. Pokemon card. Giant Heart. There's the code card right there. Before I forget it, let's go ahead and sleeve it up. And we definitely, definitely needed that for the Pokemon card binder. Ah, sleeve. Sleeve. I got to grab a sleeve over here. Secret rare. Whew. That is actually only the second secret rare besides the character cards. Only the second secret rare that I pulled from this set. The other one being Lily's Pokedoll. Nice. Okay. Okay. Last booster pack, and uh, now we're starting to warm up to those ultra rares. Do me a favor, Breaking Family. Hit the like button on this video. Let's try to get this video to, you know, 2,000 likes. It's not a whole lot. I'm not, not asking for some crazy number. Just 2,000 likes. And if you're new to this channel, welcome. Thank you for taking the time out of your day to check out this channel for the very first time. Hit that subscribe button. Become part of the Breaking Family. Energy. Red and Blue. Rotom. Type Null. Another secret rare Glade character card. There's the code card right back there. And we're going to have to add in a card to the binder. So that's good news. And a Weavile. 
How you doing, Weavile? With those winter vibes, I'm done with winter. I'm ready for it to be summer. I'm going to grab the binder. Now let's go ahead and add in the cards to our Pokemon card binder of Cosmic Eclipse. Now we needed this Reverse Hollow Blastphalon, so right here we will add this one in. We're only adding in two cards today, and one of them I'm actually very pleased that we are adding in, and that is the Secret Rare Giant Hearth. It's going to go right back here on the same page as the Secret Rare Lily's Poke Doll. If you want to see a Cosmic Eclipse Pokemon card binder update here very soon here on the channel, make sure you let me know in the comment section down below. As always, my Breaking Family, thanks for watching and taking the time out of your busy schedule to come and hang out with this weird person right here. If today was a rough day for you, remember that tomorrow is a new day, a new day for you to wake up and give it your best. Don't forget, life is awesome and so are you. I love every single one of you amazing people all around this world and I'll see all of you all of you in the next video do it with me now peace love and a high five